Welcome back, my friends. My name is Eric. This is Most of Gaming. We're back with some more Circus Electronic. We got a fight here. We got to see. We're we're closing in on this this one here. I think we'll play through this for sure, and then I'll I'll kind of look to see what the numbers look like and, and decide if we're going to play past that. Um, but we're getting close to to the bridge here. Oh, I got to put my headphones back on. All right, let's hop into this fight here and take care of this little mini quest there. All right, poison and damage over time attacks are very effective in fog. Oh, okay, so kind of any damage over time effect are effective in fog, right? Um, we haven't seen poison yet, um, so that's poison right there. So that's just physical fire, water, electric. So we haven't seen poison, but we've seen the others. All right. We haven't seen fog yet either, though, so it is what. It's. All right, consumables can be found on the items bin. Okay. So we can use one there. Use cola to increase the devotion of a team member. Okay. Use a bandage to increase it to heal. Uh, characters can also choose to use an item in their own turn beside their skills. Okay. Not just caffeine in that American drink we can make, is there? Okay. All right. Let's see what we got going on. Uh. Level two, level one, level two. So three level twos are level one. So maybe we... Um, yeah, I mean, nobody's really got low devotion. They've got a lot of hit points. Maybe we just go all in on health. Maybe we start with uh, maybe a... I mean, we could do this. They don't have any stances. I think I'm just gonna start with this one again. I really like this one. It does good damage. You know, we can usually get an extra burning or two out of it. Right? So there, there's that extra damage over time. Um, that's just for one turn. I don't know if there's going to be a lot of guys moving around. I don't need a heal at the moment. What if we try to move this guy out and light somebody else on fire? Oh, yeah, he resisted. But he did take a fair amount of damage. We're rooted, but that's fine. We don't want to move anywhere anyway. All right, we're immune to whatever that was. Um, that would move him. Oh, the fire's still there. Do I want to try that? It's going to move her forward, but that's fine. Let's see it. Let's see if we can do not targetable. Um, it's only the back two. All right, that doesn't help me as much. Um, the two mimes have yet to go, but I've had really bad luck stunning them. I think I'm just going to do damage to everybody and get a little bit more on him. My gift to you all. That was a good one. Might be the best one we've had yet. Um, you're down to 13 health. There we go. We got rid of the one level one. <laughs> but it did get us somebody and it gets him ignited. All right, the rope, we resisted. Took a little bit of damage though. All right. Ouch. That was a big hit actually. We might have to do some healing there. Um, what if we just do, uh, decrease the devotion by 10. I don't know if that really matters that much. Um, fire whip attack. So there, it does damage and then a chance that it can also light them on fire. All right, he resisted the igni igniting. I'm wondering if we should just do a heal. Yeah, that was a big hit. I mean, he's still not healed all the way. Um... We had good luck with this last time. Look out below. Decent damage with it that time, too, actually. All right, you're down to 32, which should be enough. There we go. Oh, she defended it. Nice. 
Try it again. Uh, defend it again. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and throw another fire ring on him. And ignited him. Clownish, we could do another heal. He's down a little bit. Or we could potentially just try smacking somebody. Um, you know what? I'm going to do a heal. Try to keep everybody as close to topped off as possible. We did a lot of damage to these guys with this. Let's just keep going. We got one hit, one miss. As a first miss with it this time. Now let's see if we can finish him off. There we go. All right, he took an extra bit of damage from the burning. The rope again, is he gonna pull somebody forward? Yep. Okay. That may as well, right? Probably should've just moved her back, but. Um, he has, oh, he can't do it from here. Moves forward two slots. Taunts for one turn. Okay, let's do that. All right, may as well uh, try that again. Is that enough? There we go. Yeah, yes. Got good XP out of that. Nine. Got some uh, food, more fame. Got some good components. And another skill, two more skill upgraders. We got ready to get some people leveled up. Hopefully. We're ready for that. All right, um... This looks like it's just the article that we wrote, right? All right, well, we'll see. How we do, still worth the price of admission, but barely. <laughs> but we got 11 XP and 5 devotion out of that, actually. That's pretty darn good. I'm okay with that. Oh, look how close we are. Oh, Grok got his level. Yvonne just missed out. Okay. The devoted make the best performers. That's simple. All right. Can be increased. Uh, using certain skills. Using cola. Visiting district nodes. Okay. Circus buildings. Feeding multiple points simultaneously one attack. Forcing enemies to flee and taking part in circus shows. Okay. I think we're doing okay. Um, but maybe we need to get Grok into one here. Let's see about leveling him up, though. Um, so we go here. Right, and we upgrade. We get 10 points. Um, man, his, his fun is really bad. He is the sad clown, isn't he? Um, let's go, uh, let's put most of it into here. That's already maxed, I guess. Um... If we get both of those to 10, his amazement's really low too, but at least that starts. Fun and laughs, right? There we go. Uh, and we can upgrade skills, so we can upgrade a couple of them. I do the healing a lot. Um, is it worth doing? It's an extra 2%. The taunt gives him a little bit more devotion. 3% um, more devotion boost. Now, it's only for one turn, so it's not huge. Um... I haven't really got... I, I mean, we don't have a lot of people move around a lot. Um, let's do this. And maybe just the base attack? Just to get... Or, I mean, that's not bad. I love for a little more healing. We do that a lot. And we'll call that a day. We've got a little bit left. Um, sleeping car. I don't think anybody needs to go in here. I think we're all pretty well good for that. Um, I don't think there's anything new here. Yeah, nothing to upgrade. I think we're fine. Let's go to take a look at our next show. I think we want to come back to this one. All right, let's do it going this time. So, um, we've got Caesar. 
Caesar likes a supporting fire person. -y. Um, we've got two. She doesn't like strongmen though. So maybe we go Maria. Maria, it only only needs one to like. They don't have to both like it looks like. I mean, we see the green there, the yellow there. I don't know how much that helps with the compatibility, but it probably does help. So now we need maybe a clown that likes uh, Pablo does. We put Pablo... I don't know. Are we better off there and there? Hmm. Yeah, the fact that he doesn't like that really hurts. Hmm. What if we go Balthazar, and then we go Frank, and then we go Maria, That seems pretty good. Yeah, I, I think that works. We get the double points for having Balthazar there. He likes him, so that gets us some points. She likes clowns, that gets us points that way. He likes fire breathers, so we go there. I think that works really well. That gets us, what, five? And then we could get another one by doing inventory that. So that's going to boost that. I don't know that we really need the money. Something like that, a little XP, a little little bit of everything. I think that'll work. Hold on to something. There we go. That looks oh I got all of them there. I like that. Okay. So I guess we're just back out onto the road. Oh, we'd see about creating something. Um I don't we haven't used any of that yet. Um don't have enough for that. We could make enough. Oh, no, we don't. We need two of those. We don't have enough for that either. Okay. We're not quite ready to make much more, I don't think. So let's just head out and see what type of party we can put together. We need somebody potentially for the front line. Um, Grok will do it if we need to. Now, we could put Caesar in front. He's close to another level, so that might not be terrible. Let's go that route. I think that'll be okay. All right, what's this fight? Oh, we got we got this first. Loot crate. All right. Oh, 13. Holy cow, we can we can upgrade some, and that'll let us make spotlights because that's the what we were missing. And uh the smoke bombs because we didn't have any fuel for that. Gas tanks. Okay. Um now we got to fight and then we have whatever's happening on the bridge. Um two level 2s that we know of. 1889 was a big year, and the in-show death of Shonda the Lion Tamer in spring, followed by the shuttering of Circus Electric by early summer and the founding of Steam that fall. Suspicious timing, huh? Two, 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 two. They're all level two. All right. Um, we fire whip everybody. Nobody's got a stance. I still think... I mean, that's potentially... Well, what do we say? At a minimum, 14, 18, 22. All right, whereas this is going to do significantly more. 26 to 30 to one person. What's his uh, 26? Two of them have reasonable... Um, we could lower their devotion. Right? I mean, that's 10. That gets us down a ways. You know what? I'm just going to go with this. I'm just going to go... He's got the least amount of health. But I think more people can hit him. Ouch. The healing power of well, maybe we start with that. Get him back up. 
with some arc. All right. Um. Well, we had good luck last time. Uh, to move. Do I want to move her forward one? I'm thinking we could just light somebody else on fire. Is what I'm thinking. What if we go here? No escaping this. He took his damage because he was already ignited. Now he's ignited. He took some more damage. Um. We could do Intimidate. He has been taking some damage. Could try for a stun. Um. Uses all suffered damage. Devotion increased by five. They got so much health. Um. Yeah, let's see if we can let's see if we can uh, lower his his damage up. And he continues to take damage. He missed, I guess. That's something. Um, can we put another one out here, say? Let's keep him burning. Oh, a crit! Good. Maybe it's time for another heal. Man, we're doing a lot of healing this time. That's okay. I mean, that, that's, that's fine. We lowered his uh, motivation. We might want to use a cola or something with him. Um... It only lowers it for one turn. I don't know that I can do another 11. Um, 60% chance they can't attack, though. So let's go for that. Don't try nothing. Oh, he's so close. Oh, big hit. He's almost dead. It just didn't quite work. All right. Um... Hmm. Let's just hit him. Okay. All right. We're not doing great here. Um, I think I'm going to retreat her slot. Um, and you are going to heal her. And we need to drink a cola for him next turn, I think. Yeah, definitely. Um, okay. I'm not super impressed. I mean, there's just, it, do, it doesn't seem to be useful. I mean, we do a little bit of damage with that, but it seems like they're kind of a one-trick pony at this point. Um... Although they are really close to dead. Let's just hit him hard. We've taken a lot of damage this fight. Should get rid of a couple of them, hopefully. You thought this was water. Double strike scares me. Is that all you got? All right, let's go items on you, and then heal on you. Okay, let's do another bandage on you. Okay, did a little bit of damage. Um, you've got 47 left. You've got 76 left. What if we go here? Got a chance to get you this one. There we go, nice. All right, almost there.
Um, we haven't had a chance to attack a lot. Oh, you know what I'm going to do? Move some forward and get some devotion. I'm okay with that. Although that hurt. Yeah, maybe we should have just moved her forward. He's down to 37. Um, can we get it? There we go. Nice. Man, we took a lot of damage that fight. But maybe we got a couple levels out of it. Maybe. We got a lot of XP. We can make some more bandages. That's good, because we're going to need to. Bosses cannot be chased away. Okay. All right. Normally, Randolph Master stays within the safe confines of Circus Electric, whose own form of madness recently resurrected itself the same day as the Maddening. But today, the man more commonly known simply as the Ringmaster plans to examine the happenings of the London Bridge for himself. From afar, at least. It's not every day a world landmark simply vanishes off the face of the Earth, said Masters in an exclusive interview with the Illuminated Voice. So I figured, hey, might as well check it out. Maybe even step into it. That is, after some fine Circus Electric performers have dealt with the problem, no need for needless self-endangerment, right? Since the first attack by the Vicious, some who have suspected the Remaster playing a role in the chaos, he denies such accusations. I'm a businessman who's just trying to restart his formerly beloved business, argued Masters. Why in heaven's name would I want potential ticket buyers to die in the streets? It's terrible for attendance. As this reporter has seen firsthand, many Circus Electric performers have risked life and limb to help clear the Vicious off the streets. But why? Other than attendance? I just want special people to be safe, he claimed. Odd how many mimes have tried to kill them so far, but I suppose that's just London for you. Oh wait, um, we looked at that. Uh, yeah, that was that. That was our dailies. This is the one we missed. All right. Try some new things, stumble shit entertains. We got 12 XP across the board, that, that's pretty good. We got some stuff. Nice. Three level ups, which is good. Since we're really struggling with the level twos, I mean, we're going level ones against level twos mostly. All right, so let's go ahead. Bertha gets a level up. So we'll go level up. Now we'll upgrade. Um, let's see. Um, it's already pretty close, huh, to what what her max is. We'll add one laugh in there. There we go. Now, save looter skills. Now, I use this one a lot. This one needs to be upgraded, for sure. Um, and some of these are really good. The fire looks really good. The fire whirl. Um, there's a lot of damage. I'm going to get slightly more if it does that. I do this one a lot. So, I mean, it's only an extra one damage minimum. Um, but that's across four people, right? So, potentially four damage. So, I'm going to go ahead and upgrade that one, too. Uh, this one, a little bit more devotion increase. We've had a couple that we've almost got, so I'm going to go with that. All right, let's go to Yvonne, level up, upgrade her. Let's see what she's at. Um, wow, these are terrible. There we go. We'll go for that. That's already almost max. That's whatever. But the one, the stuff she's supposed to be good at, not so much. All right, we do this a lot. I may as well get a little bit extra XP out of it. Um... I do that a lot. It is a little bit more. Um, I wonder if we should be... It's just a weird mix, you know what I'm saying? She she really does need to be at least third, right? Because that... She doesn't get this one unless she's one or two. This one she can get third. This one she can get third. This one she can get second or third. Anywhere. And only in first. So she's got a weird mix of stuff. You know what I'm saying? Um, that'd be more damage reduction, but I never run her up there because there's just so little she can do there. You know, she's only got two things, three things she can do up there, I guess. Um, I guess it's not terrible. And then if she gets pushed back one, she could do that. Um, I'm going to do this for the extra 3%. That's, that's a big, big upgrade. Um, 
and a better chance to take away their attack. I like that too. All right, let's jump into Maria here. Level up, upgrade. What was Maria got going on? Um, she's a little bit better off here um, in the stuff she's supposed to be good at. There we go, we'll apply that. Uh, once again, I want this one for sure. I haven't done this one yet. Uh, moves her to the front. She has to be at the very back. Uh, okay, so she runs up and does damage. This one just kind of scares me. Um, it deals damage to whoever, but it clears all their negative effects and increases devotion. No, I think I'm going to upgrade this. And I think I'll upgrade that. I think that's where we'll go with that. Um, Balthazar, is there anything else I wanted to upgrade on yours? We could do the Spinebreaker. We do it quite a lot. Um, just an extra plus one to max. We'll go there. We'll call that good. Do we have her in the cart? I don't know if we did or not. I guess she just didn't do anything that last time. Um, let's go ahead and set up... Let's know we'll end this one here. So next time we'll come back, we'll set up the circus, and then we'll go see what's happening with the London Bridges. I think that'll be fine. Um, go to check. I don't think there's anything going on at the train that we care about. Nah, I think we're fine. I mean, we could, we could find somebody that maybe has some slightly different... Uh, see if we find somebody that likes things we have that we care about. Um, not so much. So I think we'll stick with what we've got. All right, we'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Don't forget to subscribe. Cheers.